and you can see there's several there moving slowly along the sky with tails of fire as some listeners to BBC Radio have been describing tonight, including one that was speaking to Radio 5 Live. Brian Guthrie described a meteor that he saw in central Scotland. I was just sitting uh, watching TV and I have a side window in my front room and uh, was suddenly aware of this bright colours sculpting across the sky. Initially you think it was like very large fireworks because it was so colourful and I immediately sort of got out of my chair, looked out the window, saw it heading in a westerly direction and uh, ran to the back of the house, to the kitchen, left the light off so they could watch this and it became self-evident it was something pretty large breaking up in the, in the atmosphere. Uh, I've seen shooting stars and meteor showers before uh, but this was much larger and uh, it, it, much more colourful. Absolutely. Uh, you caught me watching it there. It's absolutely incredible stuff, isn't it? Uh, and do keep uh, your images and, uh, and stories and sightings coming into the BBC. Nina Ridge has got the weather. Pero no revolotea ni nada. Mira cómo se mueven. Luego hace una constancia de como extrañas formaciones, ya se empiezan a volver hasta casi al, vienen del poniente hacia el, oh, caray no, son aves, no, si no son pájaros, son como unas, tienen una forma bien rara, ¿qué serán? ¿Qué será esto? No, esto no tiene forma de... Esto no tiene forma de, de aves. ¿Sabe qué es? A ver... No, estos no son aves, no son pájaros. It's black. There it is. There's a big UFO. Wow.
go. It's fucking massive. this thing. It's not an airplane anyway. Back, there it is. There's a big UFO. Wow. What the hell? What is this thing? No an airplane anyway. lights in the sky last